What is up guys and welcome back to Helping Me. This will be the last video for our railways, I believe. Um, and today we're going to be adding on teleporters to the system. And I'm going to also be showing off everything else working together, including the teleporters. All right, so I'm going to explain how teleporters work really quickly, as if you guys don't know. All right, so a teleporter, basically, you link two together by going into it with F, and you set a code. The code, this is the teleporter's code that I'm working with, and this is where it teleports to. So it'll teleport to any teleporter that has this here in this area. All right, so we're going to link it by dropping the teleporter here. So now its code is where that one teleported to, and this one teleports to whichever teleporter has this at the top. And that's pretty much how they work. So, yep. Yeah. All right, so now the second biggest important thing you should know about teleporters is the way that you enter them will be the way that you exit them. So if we went speeding in, in this direction like this, we would come out of that one speeding into that direction still. See? We came in speeding the opposite way, we'd come out the opposite way. We came in from this side here, we'd be going towards the side. And the same with this direction, facing the wall now. So that is very important to know when you're adding it to a railway because you will be speeding towards the teleporter. So if you're speeding towards it and the back end of it is facing a cliff and you happen to be going in that direction, but you're trying to come out in the other direction, you will go off the cliff or into some liquid or whatever. So that's very important to keep in mind when you're making your teleporters. All right, so let's get into it. All right, I pretty much have, I've connected all of the example tracks that I've made throughout the last few videos and I've linked them together using teleporters. So I'm gonna show you basically one big ride. Let's get straight into it. I won't show you guys how to link them because it, the information I just gave you is enough to figure it out pretty much. So here we go. It's a nice little ride. Our slants. And there we have it. Welcome back. All right, so as you guys can see, that was each one of the examples that I made in an earlier video, all linked together with teleporters. So these are very effective in making some uh, complicated builds. I don't know if you guys saw the drop from up there into the teleporter down here. But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you need any like tips on how to put the teleporters or something, you can definitely leave that in the comment and I will definitely get back to you. But other than that, make sure you guys like and subscribe and you can leave any other type of comment if you like also. I do appreciate helping you guys and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace. I'm not